for Bennett, you're out there with a the lead and you got an ankle ice. <laughs> yeah. What were you thinking? Because you, oh. got, you got to finish. Well, in my semis match, I talked to my brother afterward, and obviously it was a tight one. He told me to just keep wrestling no matter the score. And that was my goal that match, and that's what I did. I wanted that tech. I talk about, in your mind, what what went into becoming the champion here. You obviously have had to have some improvement and put some um, things together with your, your wrestling in your life. Well, a couple weeks ago, I went out to Pennsylvania with my brother. Trained out there for a while at M2 Training Center. That was, I mean, that helped me a lot. And then just, I mean, Pinnacle and Castle Manor, I mean, you can't get any better training than that in the nation, so. You mentioned your brother. Talk about what are the, the things that he gives you that helps you with this. I mean, pretty much anything. He's texting me after every match, before every match, on what I need to do and what I need to do to beat the kid. I mean. And to, to get better too, so I mean, he helps me a lot. Yeah, and you, after the match, you had Brandon Paulson and Jared Lawrence there in the corner, and they definitely said that you you earned this. So talk about those two individuals in, in, in your journey. I mean, I've been at Pinnacle since I was probably eight years old, so I've been with them guys forever, and it's pretty cool to win a Fargo title with them in my corner. In winning this, you're going to get noticed even more, especially from college coaches. Are you, when will you have to start thinking about that? You'll be a sophomore this next year, right? But yeah. But it's in, within a couple of years. I mean, I won't really start thinking about it until, until I need to. I'm just going to keep trying to get better. And hopefully, I can go to whatever <laughs> college I want, I guess. What's next for you? Um, I'm going to take a little break, enjoy the rest of the summer, and I'll probably have to take like two weeks off and then have another little training period. Hey, do you feel the pressure of having two other brothers that have also <coughs> had so much success? No, no there's not. There's not pressure. I mean, the, my brothers there is helping me. Awesome. And I, I mean, the pressure, yeah, some kids will feel it, but I'm just out there and I'm wrestling. So yours is more of a support system? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, they, I mean, they help me so much. You get to train with Patrick Kennedy back home quite a bit too oh, in the yeah. summer? Or? Yeah, I train with. I mean, this last season I wrestled with him almost every day. It's great. And uh, hopefully he gets a stop sign to, tomorrow or the next day. I don't know which one it is. But Are you done after today or are you going to stick around for some Greco? No, I'm going home. Going home? Going rest, home. and Rest that ear up a little bit? Yeah, that it's, thing's, uh, it's pretty, pretty raw. Huh? I'm hopefully going to go get dr drained by a trainer right now. It's pretty bad. Sounds good. Thanks, Ben. Congratulations. Good Thank job, you. man. Appreciate it. Thank Congrats. you.